Hey, welcome to Planet Hex. I'm Andrew Horn. I've not had a chance to go out hunting in the wild for VHS or the kind of movie stuff this week. It's been a bit of a busy one with day job and kids. There's been a kids party and all kinds of stuff going on this weekend. But I thought I would go on Facebook again and have a look around Facebook Marketplace, see if I could find some more VHS goodness hidden away in all those bundles. There's also um, something I have done I need to tell you today. Something I have listened to has been the Straight to Video podcast. You know, I'm a big fan of the STV podcast with Rob Lane. I got a shout out on this one from none other than Rob and Josh Schaefer, who did the artwork for my book, VHS Ain't My Brain. He's better known around the world as the man behind Lunch Meat VHS. Do go and check out this, uh, the current episode of the Straight to Video podcast. I'll put a link to it in the show notes below. It's well worth a listen. It's well worth a listen every week, but a special one for the a special feeling towards this particular episode. So I'm going to go and have a look on Facebook Marketplace to see if anything has changed uh, since we last looked on Facebook Marketplace for VHS goodness. Of course, I am looking for X rentals and mainly horror, some sci-fi, some cyberpunk some martial arts, that sort of thing. My, my stock in trade is, uh, is horror movies on VHS, preferably large format box X rentals. Let's see what we've got here. So I've just done a search here on VHS tapes. Uh, and of course, Facebook Marketplace being Facebook Marketplace, the first thing it brought up was DVDs, 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 and DVDs. With DVDs and DVDs and more DVDs. That's a good start. Thanks, Facebook algorithm. That's really helpful. Let's see what else we can find here. So you can find any VHS tapes. Okay, we've got a bundle here. 75 VHS tapes. Let's open that in another batch. Uh, sorry, in another tab. Collection of VHS stroke videos. That's going to all be Disney, isn't it? This one looks interesting. We've got some Power Rangers and Pokemon there. That looks promising. Um, VHS tapes, children, Disney, over 50 tapes. Huge VHS videos bundle, and I see that Batman movies, Star Wars, and I know what you did last summer, and the bottom of Close Encounters of the Third Kind. So let's open that one too. Um, what else have we got? That's badass. Four VHS recorders and forty recordable VHS tapes. That's really tempting, actually. I'm having some issues with my current deck, uh, my current VHS deck. So I am. Uh, on the lookout for something like that. So that could be an interesting batch anyway. I wonder if they're working. We'll have a look at that too. Um, DVDs and VHS. And what else we got here? We've got some WWE, sorry, WWF back then. And that's all that's coming up. So let's have a look at these ones that we've got here for a start. And let's see if I can find anything to do with horror movies afterwards. So this looks all right. What we've got here, we've got lots of sports stuff. Snow White and Seven Dwarfs, Pride and Prejudice. Let's see, there's no X rentals here that I can see at all. And this is a shame. Oh, there's a Goons movie there. I like the Goons. Oh, there's... No, there's nothing there for me in that one. So that's, you know, bundle 75 uh, VHS tapes, £20. If that's your thing, go for your life. Nothing wrong with that. What else have we got here? Okay, so collection of VHS videos. Collection of VHS tapes, not free. This is free there. And no other details are given. So that's a really good start. Yeah, cheers. So this looks like um, junk on there. And lots of kids' tapes. Oh, is that it? <sighs> so this one looks more promising. <laughs> so we've got Simpsons Bart Wars. Love a bit of Simpsons. We've got one of the um, Pokemon tapes there. We've got some Power Rangers. So we've got Power Rangers in space. Some Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, Power Rangers the movie. We've got Turbo, the second movie. Some more of the regular episodes and a Lost Galaxy tape. Now, Power Rangers, it's an acquired taste. I can take it or leave it. The kids liked it for a while. I can I can watch it. I don't mind a bit of silliness. It's good fun. Um, but the thing you're looking for here, um, I would imagine that the Polygram video ones there you see with the regular Mighty Morphin Power Rangers episodes on, those would be more common. However, episodes of Lost Galaxy and Power Rangers Space um, would be a lot more sought after. So if you're a Power Rangers collector, that's a nice one. That's a nice batch. I like that a lot. But that's all there was. So, huge VHS videos bundle. Let's check this out. Huge amount of VHS videos. Includes loads of Chubby Brown and Jethro. Nothing. 
But let's see what we've got here. So it's not an entire, it's not a complete loss because I see some fun things here. So we've got Suburban Commando. I mean, come on, who doesn't love a bit of Suburban Commando with Hulk Hogan in a spacesuit? It's awesome. <laughs> it's not awesome, it's terrible, but it's fun to watch. Yeah, Close Encounters, Fallen. I keep seeing copies of Fallen in things. It was all right. The Batman movies. Let's see. Oh, this looks promising. And what have we got here? So, um, Rosie Dixon, Night Nurse. Um, MOT? An MOT video. Fast Show. Lots of stand-ups from Red Dwarf, Blackadder, St. Trinians. Um, there's an X-Rental of Die Hard 2 there. I can see it's an X-Rental because it's got the uh, the larger box. So that's uh, that's an interesting bit to see there. Flash Gordon. WCW. See, there's, there's call for the wrestling tapes. have gone. There's an interesting wrestling tapes seems to have gone up lately. I've noticed that. Um... That's a lots of Carry On films, lots of Chubby Brown. I love Carry On films. Not a Chubby Brown fan, I'm afraid. Um, hmm. No, again, not for me that batch, unfortunately. This, you know, if that's your thing, go for your life. But that's not that's not for me. So, four video recorders found in my father's house includes around forty recordable VHS tapes. Untested, thus low price, comes with all remotes and mains leads, a great project. It's Loughborough. Do you know, that's that's not bad. I, I like that a lot. Let's have a look at these these players. So we've got an LG, Matsui, a Sanyo. Uh, this one on the top, the SciShow, is really interesting. This is clearly the earliest one there. Um, yeah, those, those are the two... Um, the two middle ones are a bit later in the life of the of the um, the format. The LG, I think that's towards the end of it. Is that? Yeah, it's a VHS player. That's that's towards right at the end of the production of these things. But this one on top, that is a really interesting looking player. Yeah, that is nice. See, it's only got BBC One, Two, ITV, Channel Four listed as like preset channels there and then five six seven up to twelve I like that one touch record high quality computer control system front loading system I like that that is that fits with the aesthetic that I like that's very cool and I like that a lot see I would buy that just for the top player and that's the one I would have on display oh and there's some tapes there which okay they look used you know, I'd be curious about that. I would quite enjoy looking through and seeing what the old dude had uh, had recorded on those. It's good fun to find what's on these tapes. Um, I've done that before with the, with tapes I've been gifted. It's good to find out what's on them. It's good to see what people are into when they were getting these things together. It's a good fun. I like it. It's interesting. As I keep saying, they are historical documents. <laughs> and I stick by that. So let's have a look at this. This is one where you can't really tell what's going on at all. Mixed box of DVDs and VHS tapes. Five dollars in, in Loughborough. Just, mm, okay. So that's a, um, a large box X rental of Glimmer Man. I see Resident Evil at the top there. Star Wars Trilogy DVDs, Disney Sing Along. There's... Come on. If you're going to list something, list what's in it. Mixed box of DVDs and VHS tapes. What is it? Is it Disney all the way down? Is it the Beast in Heat? Is there Anthropophagus the Beast? Is there Cannibal Holocaust in there? Is there Cannibal Ferox? You know, it's just all the way down. It's just Nightmare Nightmare Maker. Yes, it's 18 copies of Nightmare Maker. What is it? If you want to sell something, tell people what it is. But, you know, they might have just started selling stuff. That's not, uh, not a slight against anyone. But you do need to tell people what you've actually uh, what you've actually got there. So let's, I'm going to put uh, VHS Horror, and I bet nothing comes up for this on Facebook Marketplace. Hey, hey! Results from outside your search. Okay. VHS videos for sale. Let's get that one open there. That is Rabid Grannies, isn't it? And that's Salem's Lot and Fright Night. So that's, yeah, hey. 
Oh, yes, this is more like it. A couple of DVDs there that actually look interesting. We've got VHS Forever, Psychotronic People there. Various VHS video movies. Kingdom of the Spiders. Interesting. The It. I think that shows up a lot. Horror Anthology series. That's a sponsored ad. Hmm. Pay attention, Andrew. Oh, Nightmare on Elm Street 4 VHS shop poster. Now we're talking, guys. Now we're talking. This is more like it. Free, a large amount of VHS tapes and DVDs. Something I've noticed, I've uh, been, when I've been going past places that have been uh, fertile hunting grounds for VHS, comic books, t-shirts, soundtracks, all kinds of just stuff, they're now stopping taking a lot of things. I think it's a hangover from, uh, from lockdown where everyone was filling the houses with books and movies and just checking all kinds of things out and then doing a big clear out. 100 VHS tapes for 20, for 20 quid. Um, let's open that one up. And thus people's houses are full of stuff. I see it's Cynthia Rothrock in there. That should do it. Let's have a look at these. And thus charity shops are no longer taking stuff. There's several here where I live that now have signs in the window that say we can no longer accept donations of DVDs, CDs or books for the time being. Uh, they've all stopped doing VHS anyway, so I'm having to look at collector stores for that sort of thing, but it's interesting to see how things are changing there. So let's see what we've got here. So, this looks amazing. I have 8,000 VHS tapes for sale. Horror classics, drama, thriller, telly, etc. I think I've seen this seller before. Let's see what the... Oh, yes. Now, these are uh, mass market ones by the look of it, but there's some great stuff here. Look at this. Okay, so along the top, let's see if we can pick out some good ones there. Um, yeah, that's Nightmare Maker there. On here, I can see I had Impulse. That was a fun one. Um, carry on screaming in between Cape Fear and Jeepers Creepers. I would rather watch that than see Jeepers Creepers before again. Uh, Creep Show, two copies of The Crow. Cutting Class. Candyman V. I love V. Candyman 2, the entity at the end there, another Cape Fear. We've got the Straight to Video Carnival of Souls, another Brood. This is really nice stuff. Elm Street, Clown at Midnight, Day of the Dead, the Aliens movies. This looks like a serious collector that is uh, selling things on. It's in Starbridge. Oh, oh man, this is amazing. I'm sure I've seen this seller before. Look at all that Star Trek. I've been binging Trek lately. Voyager, we've got DS9, Buffy, Star Trek. This must be like the, the back end of a store. It's blue and yellow, so I think someone may have even built their own blockbuster here. This is glorious. In the corner there, it says used like new. And it's cut the W off, so I thought it said used like me. TVs, players. Man, this looks cool. So... So many email me a wish list and I'll reply with prices from two pounds upwards. Delivery possible for local people. That looks really cool. I would give that a look in a second. Not somewhere I can get to, unfortunately, very easily. So, VHS tapes, horror, 30 pounds. That is rabid grannies. Demons, I've got that. I love that tape. Demons 2. Yeah, there's rabid grannies. Death Dimension. Lost in Time, that's a good one. These are good. Is it 30 for all of them? Yeah, that, that batch is worth 30. I would say that batch is worth 30 pounds. That's a good batch. Yeah. It's a collection in Coventry. So that's one problem with Facebook Marketplace is that you can't really get these things sent out in a lot of cases. And the, the few times that I have used Facebook Marketplace, it is really hit and miss what, what happens when stuff arrives. Uh, I, mean, some, I bought some Magic the Gathering cards when they arrived, they'd been just chucked in a jiffy bag, they were ruined, they were water damaged, they were bent, they were knackered. But, um, you know, don't recommend that. £10 for um, Fright Night and Salem's Lot. With how scarce tapes are becoming now, I would tef definitely say that is worth it. we got here, Rare Horror Preset Rental VHS Bundle Video Nasty. Let's see what we've got on offer here. Brimstone and Treacle, yep, that's rare. 
Will to Die. The Devil's Gift, that is a cut box. That looks like that was a, one of the cardboard ones or something. That's definitely been trimmed down. Bloodbath Blood Bath, Blood Bath at the House of Death, Kenny Everett there. Bloodstained Shadow. Hells Have Eyes Part 2, we'll not talk about that because it was crap. Um, Scarecrow and The Witching, that's not bad. I'm not sure I would pay 85 for that unless there's more tapes. Let's see, are there more tapes? No. So it may well be, if you're looking for those specific tapes, that may well be worth it. I would say, personally, I would think 50 or 60 rand for that at, for those titles, um, more than 85. But I think 85 is a little bit much for those, personally. That's just my opinion, and feel free to uh, tell me I'm wrong, because I usually am in many ways. Here, I open this up because I just love seeing VHS documentaries about so VHS Forever, Psychotronic People, film by Mark Williams and Darren J. Perry. I haven't seen that one. I must see that. I've seen lots of the VHS um, documentaries, as you would imagine, uh, but I've not seen that one. Okay, various VHS video films. That's just that one. So Lethal Weapon, Die Hard, and no. Thank you very much. Thank you, but no thank you. This looks amazing. Let me have a look at the state this is in. This is not in bad condition at all all okay so this is nightmare on elm street 4 this is a video shop poster that will have been used as an actual promo in video stores when uh, dream master came out and i really like that condition is good for the age of it some pinholes and one rip but overall good condition if you have any questions to ask away thanks for looking dude that is a nice looking poster didn't expect to see something like that on here tonight, to be honest. I thought it was just going to be all mass market junk, but this is really good. I like that one. Nice one. So this is a... <laughs> zero pounds. Large, large amount of VHS videos and DVDs, all sorts from horror, sci-fi, thrillers, action, romance, black and white movies. can be sold as a collection or individuals. Collection only from Canuck, Staffordshire. Sensible offers. Let's see if there's anything that jumps out here. No, then. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> 100 VHS tapes, £20. See, you're talking my language there. Let's see what we've got here. Let's see. Would I have, personally for me, would there be £20 of value in here? I see Freddy vs. Jason, Fred Bueller's Day Off. So that's two there. What's we got down here? Broadcast News on X Rental. Didn't mind that. Mars Attacks Double Pack. I think that's a double pack that came with a t shirt in it. Doubt it still has the t-shirt in it, but you never know. Robin of Sherwood. Can't go wrong with a bit of that. Um, little Shop of Horrors. Project Shadow Chaser. Yeah, I see Project Shadow Chaser in there in a slightly larger box. That may be an ex-rental. That's first independent, I think. So I think that is, yeah, Freddy vs. Jason. You know, to fill up the... Um, fill up the shelves a bit, that's not a bad batch at all. And that will be connect collection only, of course. These things weigh a lot, but that's not a bad batch at all. And let's see what we've got here. Now, this is the one I think that uh, I saw some Cynthia in. There we are. So, um, Dirty Ho, that's not a rude film, that's a martial arts movie. Curry and Pepper, Death by Misadventure. We've got there Guardian Angel, a fine Cynthia Rothrock movie. We've also got Run Lola Run, which is a great film, great soundtrack on that. And the, the rest of it is pretty standard stuff that you would see everywhere that's a shame but it is nice to know that things are looking up on facebook marketplace this is really good to see um let me see if there's any video shop poster any more video shop posters i am on the oh hello there is some stuff here yes i am on the lookout for video store stands you know the the racks that would be awesome so we've got strip tees Evita, um, Funeral of the Exorcist, framed print, that looks nice, 165 quid, might be pushing it a bit though. Original movie shop posters, 90s era, let's open that up. Nintendo video game posters, Superman 4, The Quest for Peace, Bob Wire standee. <laughs> I've got to see that. I liked that film, I liked that film, and not for what went on in the credits, I liked the movie. So it's less of a mixed bag than I expected. I'm pleased this time out for uh, what we found here on uh, Facebook Marketplace. Let's have a look at that. That's a great looking standee. 
couldn't pay £60 for it though. Um, no postage inquiries. Not for me. It's a shame that. Let's see what we've got here in these, these uh, posters. I loved video store posters and I had so many of these. I'm guessing that's yeah, £4 each. Uh, postage available, discount for multiple purposes. Problem child, state of grace, Benny and June, nothing but trouble. Nothing jumping out here, no. That's a shame, that's a shame because I thought that looked promising, but you know, it's good to know that there is stuff still out there. Standees, posters, video posters, VHS tapes, there's still some ex rental going on out there. These things are out there if you look. And I'm going to carry on looking for a bit. There's, uh, look out for my mini episodes throughout the week. There's going to be a full length episode of Planet X each weekend like this one. And in the week you can find two episodes of the mini mini show Planet X Review Time. Just this evening watched uh, Batman and Superman Battle of the Super Sons with the kids. So that's going to be one of the reviews this week. So look out for those episodes throughout the week. And each weekend you'll find a full length episode of Planet X. Do you listen out for the straight to video podcast as well. As I say, there's a link down below. And look out for me. If you're around the Nottingham area, look out for me at the weekend. You may see me around hunting again. I'm Andrew Want. Thank you ever so much for watching this episode of Planet Hex. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and validate my existence.